Good morning. I'm in Sylvania, Alabama. I'm at the lake. It's a beautiful morning. It's about 53, 54 in the degrees. It's, uh, I couldn't tell you about quarter after 7, 20 after 7, I don't know, something like that. But uh, we're here at the lake. Um, I've been getting skunked way too many times. I can't remember the last time I caught a fish. It's been quite a while since I caught a fish, as you can see in my videos. And I hope this video was not not the same. I hope this video is different. I hope I catch a couple fish for you guys. It's Sunday morning. The lake is alive. We got boaters. We got fishermen out here. It's going to be a good morning. I ain't got all morning to fish. I just got a couple hours. And uh, I'm going to enjoy what little time I had to fish. So let's get to it and uh, hope we catch a fish today because I'm tired of that daggun skunk. So let's do it. Good morning and I'll be fishing a slim shake worm from Guggen's. I got a real lighter weight on there, so I hope I hope we break the curse of being skunked. But if not, you know, we get to get out and fish. That's all that, you know, that's all it that really matters. Get out here with nature. Get out here. It's you, the lake, hopefully a fish or two. But just enjoy your time. Slow it down and fish. You could fish as thorough as you want. You can pick apart a spot. I'm just gonna have fun because you know I I get to fish a lot so. Yeah, I get to fish a lot. You know, I think about those people who only get to fish, you know, once a month or once a week or, you know, and they're all, and those guys are sitting, you know, at work, you know, wanting to do, you know, what I'm doing. Yeah, you know, I get to come out and fish and I think of my fellow anglers sitting at work, sitting, you know, doing what they don't want to do while I'm out here enjoying the wildlife. I don't want to spend a lot of time at this spot. I haven't fished here in a long time. and Actually, I haven't been to Sylvania in Oh, I can't remember. It's been a while since we've been to Sylvania, huh? I always take y'all with me when I come to Sylvania, so. It's been a while since we all been here. Just want a bite. I don't care if I catch a dink today. Although I am tired of catching dinks, I want to catch a big one. What a beautiful morning. It's a little chilly, but hey. Like I said, it's in the 50s. That's beautiful. Compared to what it could be. Man, we could be in the 30s. It could be raining. It could be snowing. I could be back in Michigan. Now, I heard back in Michigan, they got, they got their first snow already. I don't know how true it is, but... Phew, snow before Halloween. Not unheard of, but I don't want snow, period. No snow, no ice. I don't want it. I don't want to deal with it this year. You know, what's your thought on about, you know, 
I'm really shy, so it takes a lot for me to, you know, get some of these video, videos done when there's a lot of people in there, like there's boaters over there, and, you know, there was a boater behind me, but I don't know, yeah, he's back there still, but, you know, I get really camera shy, well, not camera shy, but I get shy around people, and it's hard for me to talk, so, you know, it takes a little bit for me to get these videos put together. But man, I have a heck of a good time doing it, you know. I get something to do while I'm fishing. I get to talk to y'all. You know, I love I love talking to y'all because y'all give me good feedback. Y'all send me messages, you know, you leave me comments and I'm not afraid of criticism, you know. Criticize me, you know. Tell me what I should be doing or what I shouldn't be doing. Am I too loud? Am I too soft-spoken? Uh-oh. little fish jumped right there. What line is your favorite? What kind of fishing line, you know, do you spool up with? Now, on this reel, I got 17 power XL, Trilene XL. If I'm using Trilene, 10 times out of 10, I'm using XL. I love that XL. I don't use XT. It's a little, it's a little bit thick for my carrying. Let's get out in some deep water. Look at this. This is what pisses me off. Look how close this garbage is to the garbage can. If you can't pick up your garbage and throw it away or take it with you, don't come to the lake. Keep your ass off the lake if you can't clean up after yourself. We don't want to come here and look at your worm containers. We don't want to come here and look at your empty beer containers. I don't want to come here and look at your fishing lines scattered all over the place. I come here to fish, not pick up after little children. Pick up after yourselves. Alrighty. We're at another spot. Come on, fishies. There's a meme I see on Facebook every day where it says, you know you tried it here, fishy, fishy. And I do it every time I come fishing. Here, fishy, 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 fishy. You know, I want, I want me a fish. I mean, I'm tired of that skunk, you know. That damn skunk's been on my neck, on my back, wringing my neck. I'm tired of that old skunk. Yes, sir, footage, but I come up with a joke saying I should have called my channel Skunk TV. Getting skunk so much, you know, it's just, it's become totally insane how much a person gets skunked. Beautiful scenery, just beautiful. B E A beautiful. Well, that's a cruddy cast, but we make the best of cruddy cast too because you just never know where them bucket mouths are. Now, do you have a favorite color lure? What's your favorite color lure? You know, people got favorites they stick to. It don't matter if the water's clear, clean, dingy, crystal clear, you know, people got their favorite colors. It don't matter. I go with naturals. I don't care how dirty the water is. I'll, I'll always go with a natural color. Because we got to give these fish some credit. You know, fish ain't stupid. People like to say they're stupid because they bite lures. They're not stupid. They're just, they're just hungry. And the next spot it is. I'll catch you at the next spot.
And it's supposed to be a nice day today. They say it's going to be in the high 70s. I'll take high 70s any day in the end of October. But, you know, I'd rather have it raining and catch some fish than have sunny skies and not catch any fish. So I'd like it both ways, you know. I'd like it, you know, give me some rain, give me some sun. I want to fish, that's all I want. So I'll hit you up when my ride is rigged. Peace. Here we are, back at the other spot. I've been fishing for a while and I just forgot to turn my camera on. So I've been sitting here talking to myself like a, I don't know what, jabbering on, thinking I was talking to the camera and it was turned off, so. What's your favorite bait, man? Let me know in the comments, you know, do you like Zoom, you like Guggen, Culprit? Are you like one of the guys that use all of the above? Me, I'm mainly a Googans man. I find they're, you, know, you know, they got mid price baits. You know, they're not expensive, they're not cheap, they're in between, you know. They're by far my favorite baits, you know. When I go to a tackle shop, Walmart, or anything, that's the first thing I look for is their Guggen selection. Is that a dead fish over there? Looks like a dead fish laying in the water over there. But it is, that's pretty sad, because more than likely it don't look big and it looks like... Yep. It's a dead bass. I don't know if the camera can pick it up, but... There's a dead bass in the water there. And I hope nobody killed that bass. That breaks my heart to see a dead fish. Breaks my heart. Oh, well, cast it right into a Right into a snag. Oh, what is that? I got something. That's not a fish. No, oh, it's a tree branch. Woohoo! Tree pounder. Oh, I'm getting bit. Oh, I missed him. Oh, I missed him. Oh, I was getting bit. I got bit. <laughs> Man, I got bit. Goose, you're going to be cooked. Yep. Where'd your friends go? I'll see you in Rainsville. <laughs> I'm in Rainsville. <laughs> voila! 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 However you say it and however it's said. 
Oh, right into a tree. First thing, what do you know? Right into a tree. Do oh, I got it? Oh, I got it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Finally. What do I got? Yeah. Yeah, that's a fish. I got him. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah, what do I got here? What do I got here? Ooh, I got me a bass. Ooh, look at you. Look at you. Finally, look at that nice bass. Hoo-wee, I caught myself a bass finally. No more skunk TV. Look at that. She ain't the biggest, but she's got a tummy on her. Hoo-wee. Let's get her back into the water, huh? Let's get her back into the water. There you go, baby. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> That's good. Oh, I'm getting bit right there, right at the shore. <laughs> Ooh. Another nice Bama bass. Ooh, and the hook just fell right out. Ooh, look at that. Look at that crud off there. Ooh. Not skunk TV today, boys. I'm telling you what. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Look at that. Beautiful bass. Thank you. Thank you. Got another one. Oh, I missed him. I missed, I missed another fish. No, I didn't. There we go. <laughs> Got this guy. Oh, <laughs> oh no. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh. A hit. <laughs> that was a hit. That's a snag. 